Hi, I'm Annalene Scott. I'm Kennedy Brumfield. And I'm Carly Whitenet. And we're here to talk to you about... Today, we're going to talk to you about gravity on the moon. And since we're talking about the moon, we decided to teach it to you here on the moon. Have you ever wondered how much you weigh on the moon? Well, you'll find out today. Also, we are going to tell you how you're so much lighter. We are also going to tell you about phases of the moon. It'll be a blast! Wow! Let's say you weigh 70 pounds on the Earth. On the moon, you would weigh about 11 pounds. This is because on the moon, gravity isn't as strong as it is on the Earth. In fact, Earth's gravity is six times stronger than the moon's gravity. However, your mass does not change. For example, if you are a size 12 on Earth, you're still a size 12 on the moon. You don't just slim down a bunch. Once you get on the moon, gravity is just not as strong. So if you jump like this, you go really high. <sighs> Have you ever wondered what all the phases of the moon look like? Well, you're about to know. The first phase is called the new moon. Ooh, like in twilight? Yes, Anna. Like in twilight. Hey, who turned out the lights? See, this is a new moon. Oh. Anyway, when there's a new moon, the side of the moon facing the Earth is not lit. That's why you can't see it. The next phase is a waxing crescent. Oh, I just love crescent rolls. Mmm. Hey, there's more now. Yep. And as the moon revolves around Earth, you see more and more of the lit side until you see all of it. Woo! Wasn't that fun? By the way, did you know that nobody's gone on the moon since December 1972? Also, there are big lakes of frozen ice on the moon. In 1994 and again in 1998, we had a spacecraft fly by the moon, and they found proof that there are frozen lakes in some really deep basins. So today, we learned about gravity on the moon and phases of the moon. Also, you learned some pretty awesome facts about the moon from me. I'm Anna Wayne Scott. I'm Kennedy Brumfield. And I'm Carly Whitenet. Thank you for watching. Keep exploring.